Hey everybody, Jeff here. How's it going? Happy Friday. Uh, we are looking at a short stream tonight. Uh, there's not much left to do in the game, and I want to get it done before Extra Life. So we don't have any, like, leftover stuff once we start that. Speaking of, hey everybody, Extra Life is tomorrow! Can you believe it? Holy crap, I can't. I am super anxious about it. <laughs> um, but yeah, we're going to be doing a 24-hour charity stream tomorrow, starting at noon. Uh, benefiting Children's Hospital of Wisconsin. We're going to be playing Mass Effect Andromeda. Uh, 24 hours. Uh, all donations go to Children's Hospital of Wisconsin. Every $10 donation gets you an entry into the prize pool. Uh, so make sure you tune in, check it out, tell your friends, all that fun stuff. How is the battery low on this? What? All right, hold on. What happens when you don't have USB-C? Hey! Apparently only one of those cords works, and it's not the one that I thought it was. <laughs> So, there's only two things left to do in the game. Um, we head to the Council of Valkyries, and then the end of the game. I do just want to check. Let's see here. I think I moved some... I have Valkyries Bane still. Can I upgrade anything? All right, what'd you break? Oh, you know what I can upgrade? Because uh, I did... I, I realized something after stream last night. One of the items we need to upgrade the axe was in that, in one of those chests in the uh, the middle of uh, Muspelheim. And I had enough mist echoes to grab it. So I went back and I got... Did I not get it? Pretty sure I got it. Hold on. I definitely remember getting it. Huh. Awesome. Cool. Already off to a great start. Oh, I know what I did. Okay, hold on. I got... I was close. What I got was the... Oh, not Muspelheim. Niflheim. That's where it was. Um, Raging Inferno of Muspelheim and the... Oh, where is it? The Chilling Mists of Niflheim. That's what I grabbed. Okay. So I have to make Let's those. Get to it. Um. Yes. Okay. So let's make our Frozen Flame. And our Chaos Flame. There we go. I got very worried there for a second. Get some breathing ahead. Woo, worthy. And the Blades of Chaos. Blades is gonna sing now. Why fight it? Okay. Now. What I'm currently wearing, I think, is still some of the best armor I have. I think we might stick with this. Uh, let's just make sure. Resurrection Stone. Bye. Because we're going to need it. Alright. Was that all there is? 
That is all there is. There isn't any more. All right, let's head to the Council of Valkyries, which is right here. I really panicked there for a second. Ooh. All right, come on, door. Now we'll have to see how this goes. All right, let's put the rest of these helmets down. Which ones are... Oh, they're all lit now. They're just not... Okay. Hi there. How are you? Oh, you're already sitting. Oh, what is that? What was that? Secrets? I found a secret. Unstable ore? Used to upgrade pommels with expl- Oh. Eye of Runic Supremacy. Taking damage during a Runic attack reduces damage taken by 30%. Yeah, not worried about that. I don't even think that's a, uh, a treasure map that I had. <laughs> right, five. Oh, I can talk to them. This is Rota. A chooser of the slain. I thought all the Valkyrie did that. Not exactly, lad. Although that is what they're most famous for, and by far their greatest responsibility. You've seen what happens to the dead without the judgment of the Valkyries. Yes. Hellwalkers. That's right. Rota, Gunnar, Skuld. Without them to clean up the aftermath of battle, hell overflows with souls meant for Valhalla. A sorry state of affairs. Rota must be beside herself. I mean, she seems okay. Um... This is none other than Gerdrifold, the master of arms in Valhalla. She was Responsible the one that... for arming and training Odin's Inheriar. His what? His army come Ragnarok. The entire reason Valhalla exists, you see. The Inheriar wait in the Great Hall endlessly, feasting, drinking, and fa... Ah, uh, fornicating themselves silly. Jeez. Once Ragnarok begins, Odin calls them into service to fight on his behalf. Gerdrifold had her hands full training that lot. How long has she been, like, stuck in mortal form? Already did that one. Haven't done this one. Ah, Gondul. Beautiful Gondul. And? Huh? That's it? <laughs> Beautiful Gondul? No story or anything? Uh, oh, sorry, lad. The sight of Gondul always took my breath away. Gondul had a silver tongue, a sharp wit, and struck a figure so stunning it literally drove men insane. Odin forbid her from setting foot in Midgard after a time, as insanity is not a welcome trait in Valhalla. Yeah, I can see where that would be a problem. All right, um, who's up next? You, whoever you are. Ah, here we have Air, the healer. A Valkyrie healer? Strange. Air was yeah, she didn't strange, fight like a fact, healer. Very quiet. Very calm. Where her sisters were violent rapids, Air was a gentle stream. She healed the wounds of both mortals and gods. And even a certain all-knowing sage who once drank too much and fell off a mountain. Ugh, not my proudest moment. Okay. Finding out more about you there than I did about the Valkyrie. This is number eight. Oh, well, well. Hilda, mistress of battle. She and Odin got on quite well, actually. Her and the other Valkyries, not so much. She would spend most of her time here in Midgard observing discord between the living and sewing some up herself from time to time. She lived for conflict. Some say she was conflict personified. I wonder what will become of her now that she's free. 
All right, and last one, but this isn't this isn't actually the last one because let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There's still the queen. Once the daughter of a powerful chieftain. She fell defending him during a reaver attack. Orun was escorted to Valhalla, where she chose to devote her afterlife to the pursuit of knowledge above all else. Quite unusual behavior amongst the constant drinking and feasting of her fellow Valhallian denizens. How'd she end up with Valkyrie? Odin. He saw a kindred spirit in Orun's single-minded pursuit of knowledge. He appointed her as the Valkyrie's resident historian. So you can just make Valkyries? I thought they were like born or something. All right, let's do this. Oh God, damn! That was. I can't believe I blocked that on the first try. Oh, she's taking like no damage. Oh, okay, that has a long reach. Ow. Oh, this one might be a little tough. Ow. Come on. Oh, she can't be. She can't be interrupted in the air. Ow. I'm fine. She got everybody's moves. Are you kidding? Oh, she can be. Not for very long. Damn it. There we go, come on. Get some health back. More health, please. Why am I not blocking the things that I'm supposed to? Oh, because I'm still in rage mode. Ow! You don't want Are we to even at half? We even have her down to half? No. Okay, this might be a, a, a later, might be an after game thing. Ouch. Oh, that sucks. on that is nuts. It's not even fair. Ow. Damn it. That's it. So that's it then. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> okay. Hmm. Do we have anything else that helps against Valkyries? I don't think the Valkyrie armor... Uh... Okay, yeah, it doesn't help against Valkyries specifically. Alright, let's try this again. 
Ow! Yep, I know. So, at least she doesn't hurt me. Back up! Damn it. Another one? Oh, ho, ho, ho. oh, she is not fun to fight. Yeah, I'm doing great. Oh, I dodged the wrong way. That was on me. Ow! I mean, no, not even gonna try. <laughs> I've gotta have something better I can use here. Oh, new skills, that's right. Here's the number of strikes in Chaotic. Let's see here. Runic 12. I have anything better than that. Runic 14. Increases all burn damage. That one, I have the winged chosen, cooldown 13. I don't think I have anything better than that, or cooldown. Yep. And Vari Soul, Runic Vitality and cooldown, health burst. I get something that's maybe plus to two of them. Here's Shard is good at everything. Asgard's Shard of Existence. Oh, Fortification, I forgot about this. So we're up. <laughs> How can I get more of those? That's my question there. Okay. I don't think I have anything that's actually better. In my current loadout. Oh, back up. Ready and wait. Oh, shit. Ow. Glad I grabbed that health. Oh, 
Okay, we gotta be smart about it. Why can't I target her? There we go. Whoa! Ow, holy shit. Nothing. Ow, she did it twice? That's new. Oh. I don't think I can beat her. <laughs> I don't think I'm good enough. <laughs> No! She is kicking my ass. I mean, I didn't think this fight was going to be easy, but... Do I have any better armor? I'd have to upgrade that. Be Brock's? Defense 58, 64. I lose some vitality. Gain a bit to everything else. All right, let's. All right, looks like we're going back with the dwarven armor. Oh, I hate the way it looks. <laughs> let's try this again. Ah! <laughs> He's so angry. Why are you so angry? I helped all of your sisters. Ow. Ow! God damn! Oh, that one coming. Yep. Ow. 
Didn't see that one coming. On the wear. Boy, do something to help. Oh god, that was close. Oh, damn it. Okay, that's it. Okay. okay. You know, I don't think... <laughs> Just skill-wise, I don't think I can beat her. Like, if I... I could upgrade the armor some more. Let's see if we can do that real quick. There should be a shop pretty close to here, actually. Yeah, it's right back across here. See if we can upgrade this, and then if we can, we'll give it another shot. And, uh... <laughs> if not, we'll just go end the game. There's no way whatever's at the end, like... I mean, she's obliterating me. We've we've handled everything else. At least gotten, like, most enemies and bosses down to hell half before they killed us. I don't think I've got her anywhere close to half yet. Alright, where's the shop? That's my immediate question. Ah, I hear it. Here we go. What speaks to you? Why can't I upgrade my current thing? I suppose you prefer my... My brother's work? <laughs> oh, You're I need wrong, both of them to do it. That's right. Crap. Um, okay, where's the nearest door? I forgot, this armor needs both of them to do it. And it can only be done in... Temple. I mean, it's right there. Is there even a point in using the door? I don't think so. I think it'd take longer to use the door, actually. Well, maybe about equal time. Okay. What about the giant with eight arms? Oh, I really want to hear Star this story. Starcast but... <laughs> the mighty, he was called. If the Giants ever had anything so organized as an army, Starkath would have been their general. An opinion, in retrospect, I should have kept to myself. But no, as Odin's advisor, I kept him advised. And having bent his will towards Starkath's doom, there was no dissuading him. But even Thor wasn't stupid enough to take on Starkath on his own. No. Instead, the Aesir set forth slanders upon Starkath's name. Branding him throughout the realms as a monster to be feared. They said he abducted an elf queen who killed herself rather than be ravished by the giant. Lies, of course, but you're too young for her story. I'm not. In the end, even the Vanir gods and the armies of Midgard were roused to the cause. They surrounded Starkath, showered him with arrows until he was brought to his knees. He surrendered, hoping by trial he could clear his name. Thor took advantage and ripped off one of Starkath's arms. 
which only made it easier to sever another and another until he was satisfied. Relieved of six arms and too much blood, Starkath perished upon the battlefield. Or such a dick. Uh, I regret it to this day, you know. I told myself there was nothing I could do, but I wish I'd tried. All right, fun story. Glad we had that talk. Once more to the horn. No, no horn yet. Armor first. We have to try and kill the queen bitch. Oh, I need mist echoes. <laughs> yeah, okay, we're not doing that. That's it. Um, Really wish I had known about that swapping out the, uh, swapping out the, whatchamacallums. Alright, well, she's gonna kick my ass a bunch. I am not ready for her. Um, and we're at the end of the game, so I will probably try and make a video or something of that later. But, I don't want to stream too long tonight, so let's hit up the horn. Let's horn it up. So we're looking for... The serpent swallowed something, right? Yormi? Yormi, you ate something? Steady. <laughs> All right, head. How's he doing that without lungs? Oh, that's right. We need the... This is that you lost to us. Ah, uh, he thinks it might still be in his stomach. Um, and he's open to letting you go into his mouth to look inside. Oh! Ew. Really? Oh, by the by, he's not wild about it either. Okay. <sighs> Back to the boat, I guess? Boat into the serpent's mouth. So, are we really doing this? Letting the serpent swallow us? You do not have to come. Well, I'm not gonna miss this. <laughs> That's the right attitude, boy. Idea? No. Oh, 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 oh. Holy. Oh, Reggie's gonna be sad. She missed this. Well, brothers, I've been to many strange places, but this will be a new one. <laughs> yeah. I've never been in a giant's belly either. How about you, Father? Never one that was not trying to eat me. We really should expect our sort of response at this point. This is not where I expected this to go. Is he 
closing? Like, it's gonna tilt up? Oh, yep, here we go. This has got a reek. You know, he looks a lot smaller on the inside. Funny. I used to dream about getting eaten. Dreams are nothing. I'm not afraid. It okay, just now he looks me bigger. Of the way I used to feel when I was a child. All right. Let's find that I forgot we're looking for Mimir's eye. Oh, there's too much stuff in here. Huh. Smells not as bad as I thought it'd be. Bit like heather ale fermenting. That pleasant, actually. You're so weird. Yeah, if you say so. What's that down there? Part of a building, by the looks of it. The water kind of burns in here. That is water. Isn't no. Hi. You want to be here? Um. Here. What else is he eating? There, the hammer. What about the hammer? Oh, over there. Getting Resident Evil 2 remake flashbacks now. Shit, that's fancy. Or not fancy, but shiny. I don't even remember what this statue looked like. He ate it so long ago. Where's their jogger? Is that what I'm supposed to take that, or what? Oh, okay. I need... I don't know what I need. Let's get up here and take a look. Maybe if that was closer. Okay, so I need... Okay. I need to turn it one more time. Nope! There we go. That'll do it. That'll do... Uh... Platform that will do. All right, and now if I Good God. I get something. I'm way more of Yormi than I ever wanted to. Come here. Any idea where Odin hid your eye? No. It's not like I can still see through it. Oh, it's moving too. Ew. Gross. Well, I'm guessing this is probably where he hit it, right? Tell me we just like shove it in. Yep, that's an eye. Maybe you should stick that in my head for safekeeping. Oh, we are. Gently now, gently. Oh, he looks weird with two Thank eyes. You, brother. You don't miss depth until it's gone. You sure about that?
Well, yeah, I mean, it's not gone, so you can't miss it. Yeah. <coughs> that makes sense. Okay. Are there any birds in here? Tell me we go in... Go out the way we came in. Please. It's so orange. Uh, it's like he ate nothing but, like... Well, I wouldn't say I'm feeling the whole again, part but it's a of great spaghettios. The Bifrost is intact. It'll serve. Then we have all we need. Finally, we're going to Yudin. There's no stopping us now. Laddie, have you ever heard the term tempting fate? Fate is another lie told, told by, by the, the gods. gods. Yes, of course. You really are your father's son, you know. We're too small a meal, right? Those so teeth. How do we get back out? We signal. Whoop! Hold on! What's going on? Well, that was mildly terrifying. Maybe our presence is upsetting Jormungandr's belly. No, it sounded no. like he got hit. Something is wrong. Nothing good. Glad that's over. It can't be is killed, it right? Hit? What is that? We must hurry. Couldn't agree more, brother. Like Yormagander has a role to play in Ragnarok. There's no killing it. Uh oh. Hold tight and watch your balance. Oh god. The board shifting! I'm gonna I have you. Oh god. Oh! Oh, where are we? Uh oh. Boy. What? Boy! Oh, I'm good. I think I'm getting kinda used to this. <laughs> what happened to him? Something we did? That was not us. No. Where's the head? Something else. Oh. A dead giant. Oh, we're back here. Why would the serpent leave us here? Look! Oh. Uh... Bird? Wait, is that... Hi! Freya. We can still trust her. Why are you wearing right? chainmail? Until we scale. Know certain, keep a distance. The world serpent. What's happened here? We hoped you would know. Your whole outfit looks alone. different, right? I'm looking for my son. She's not down here, bud. The two of you. You helped me see things more clearly. You do not know where he is then? No. But the woods and fields speak his name. I know he walks here in Midgard. When did you see him last? I don't remember your tattoos being Long so shiny time. either. Before you were even born. Why are you standing so far from me? What's wrong? Something's happened. Oh. There! We know what you did. We know what you are. Oh, God. Oh, he was punching the... He was punching the I army out of the water. I had a feeling okay. hurting the big snake would bring the two of you out in the open. Do you have any idea, any idea at all, what you have cost me? Who's he talking to? Kratos or? Oh. My boy. Okay. What did Kratos cost him? Mother. I'm here. Don't run away. Last oh, time we I'm saw him, he was in hell anywhere, trying to kill her, right? Mother. I know that you're still angry. I know that how you feel hasn't changed, but I, I want you to... How, how I feel? 
how I feel. <laughs> I've spent the last 100 years dreaming of this moment. I've rehearsed everything I ever wanted to say to you, every word, to make you understand exactly what you stole from me. But now, I realize I don't need you to understand anything. I don't need you at all. Oh, back off, Kratos. This has nothing to do. This path you walk, vengeance. You will find no peace. I know. You... I'll deal with you later. But family first. Yeah, this is... <clears throat> You've lost every fight we've had. This again? Jack, you gotta go upstairs and get ready for bed. Why? Because you can't be watching this. It's too much for you. Oh, yes. Wait. I know. I know this. I watched it. All right. I love you, buddy. I'm gonna come up and put you to bed. Okay. All right, Balder. Let's do this. You have to go. Please. Whoa! What the? I can reach you. you can you? Oh, good job, boy. Keep him. Oh, Damn it. Freya. Oh, God, he's so bad. Your blood. Listen to me, both of you. I won't hurt you, but you must stop me. You, I don't think you can. Yeah, uh, one, there's no talking him out of it, and I don't think you can hurt me. Well, maybe she can. But she can probably hurt Kratos, but I don't think she can. Kill I don't even know where she, Where is she? I don't like it. She, ow. Ow. Not wait, no, get him too, not fair. Oh, she's up there. You might want to turn away, boy. This won't be pretty. I won't let you hurt him. No boy. Fine. Stop! Oh. No! Atreus! Oh god! You're bleeding! Breathe, boy! Breathe! Holy crap. Not my blood. <clears throat> what? Oh, the mistletoe. What is that? That last arrow that he used to fix it, and she got rid of all of his arrows. I can feel Oh, that's this. why. That's how you break the curse. Or whatever, the spell. Oh, I can feel everything. <laughs> we don't need to fight now, right? He's vulnerable now? Huh? Why? Come on. I got what you, you got what you wanted, right? Oh god. Oh, it's the giant. You will Now, wasn't her whole reason for making him invulnerable that, like, there was a prophecy that he would die a needless death? Like, that, this is some self-fulfilling bullshit. On? Is Freya trying to kill us? No. Do you hear the wind? We are moving. That arrow? Balder Bunch, the mistletoe? In the quiver strap, yes. Wait, how's the, the quiver staying on now? Him. Freya said it was wicked. He's more than harmed. The spell is broken. He can be killed. I'm certain of it. It's all coming back now. Now he remembers. <laughs> Good for you, Mimir. Um, where are we going, though? Seriously. Ow. 
Oh, hi there. Nothing? You're still dead, right? Dead wow, she's got a lot of power to bring something that big back to life. Him. No, woman. You cannot. He means to kill you. Yep. Can't stop me. Oop. Hold on. I want to get... He looks so pissed off. There we go. No one can. Where is he? I don't care if he kills me. I will protect him. We should I really just leave this family to their own shit. Now, Sachi, this will all be over soon. There. Get him! Oh God! You will stop this. Yep. Now. I'm determined to not use the axe. We're doing this mano a mano. Thank you, Valkyrie Protection. Are you enjoying this as much as you thought you would? Oh, never mind. There's both the axe. I feel. Ow. Freezing. Okay, fine. I guess the game. Wait, he's freezing. Oh. Okay, so it's not gonna. God damn it! With the snow. Better than I remembered. Okay, I can't still hit him. But it does do nothing. I was really hoping it would just let me punch him to death. Way easier than the Valkyrie Queen. Sigurd. Sigrun? Ow! You have to make your father To be fair, I'm only fighting him because he wants to kill you. Damn it! This can hold me! Seriously, stop. Weak mother. Mother. Oh, come on. Not what I want to do. Oh, God. Ow. Man, why couldn't you have fought like this before? You just didn't give a shit? Ow. I like how quick he is, like... I don't know, something about like the I like I like fighters that use a lot of speed. Oh god! Oh you will stop. Will I? Will I? Nope, nope. Is that a ring? I mean I don't really get crystal! Oh I get the you know why Baldur's fighting. And I get that Kratos doesn't want Baldur to kill Atreus. Freya. Atreus! But I'm okay. also. I'm okay. This is a lot. <laughs> and I'm doing wonderful. I never felt so alive. 
Hit him? Did I hit a reaver into? Yes! 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 Enjoy the axe. Ow! What the? Okay, it's not cool if you bring friends. Like, well, I mean, it's fine. I'll kill them too. Ow! What are you the god of exactly, Balder? How come you get ice and fire? God, those kicks! Try to get my whoops. Come on. Oh, there we go. Oh ho 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 ho. Oh. Oh, he's just crazy, huh? I'll kill you! He's just full on nuts. Uh, how do I get up there? Oh, I can. Okay, it didn't give me the icon for it. Stop blinking at me! Boy! I was gonna say catch, but I have to catch you. You don't have to do this! You know when he's done killing you, he's gonna kill us, right? Like... Ow! Please. Ow, ow, ow! Been enough pain. Oh, it's not giving me the prompt this time. Come on! Whoop, boy! Shoot him! There we go. Oh, God! Oh, ho, 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 ho! Good shot, Atreus. Oh, we're gonna snap him. Oh! Woohoo! Oh, damn! Oh, those are all like straight through him now, right? I mean, still, God, he's not that easy to kill, but then again, I've got plenty of practice at it. <laughs> the giant just like, Who are you, die? I want to thank you. Both of you, you've done what even the All Father himself could not. I've never felt more alive. Well, that's fitting that, you know, you feel this at the end. Whoop. Hold on. Let me put that down. What? Yeah, I am not using my full strength. This isn't even my final form! Bullshit. Oh, I'm out of it now, shoot. Where'd he go? Wow. Ah. 
<laughs> I don't think so. Damn, okay. Move, move. I want it to be an interesting fight. That's why I'm using it. I want you to know I can take you down so easily, Balder. God, I wish I could move this fast Switching to ice. Come on. Ow. There we go. I'm finally getting the hang of that turning things back around. Or throwing projectiles back. Maybe a couple more times. Shoot him a couple more times, boy. Just in case. What part of the giant are we fighting on now? All of you! You must Ow! Ah! Oh ho ho! Sun activities! Oh god! Oh hell! Wait, is he blowing or sucking? Is he calling the... Is he calling Yormi? Well done, boy. Fuck yeah! Oh! Oh, I love you, boy. Wait, punch him some more? Oh, he's beaten several times over, yes. <laughs> hey, Sarah, sorry. Again. Welcome to the end of the game. Touch her. He got his need your curse lifted. Let that be a lesson to you. Help yourself. Can you, mother? No matter what, what I do or say, you won't... You won't stop interfering in my life! I was just trying to protect you! I wa Come on, admit it. I've made mistakes. I know. But you're You free. turned him into a psycho. You have what you want. Try to find forgiveness. We can build something new. No. No. We can. Because I will never forgive. Lifetime that you stole from me. I have paid. I have paid. But if that alone will make you whole, 
if seeing me dead will make things right. I Are you excited for tomorrow, Sarah? <laughs> Give mommy a hug. <laughs> I didn't know. But he was, well, first off, gods can die. Kratos has killed a lot of them. Um, the entire yeah. Greek pantheon. But he was... He chose this. Invulnerable because of a spell. Uh, but the spell was broken by uh, him getting pierced with uh, mistletoe. Every violation imaginable upon you. No violations, please. I will parade your cold body from every corner of every realm and feed your soul to the vilest filth in hell that is my promise he I'm pretty sure you life. can't do anything he robbed me of everything <laughs> everything so yeah she plays the spell on him to make him invulnerable as a baby you but he couldn't feel animal. anything uh, Passing on your cruelty and rage, you will never change. What are you talking about? I killed my I dad. I stopped me. him from killing you. I know enough. Does he? About to find out, I bet. Um, Atreus had a uh, a mistletoe arrow. Boy, holding his uh, one of the, like his Listen chest belts, and fucking Balder like punched I'm him so hard it practically. Sparta. I made a deal with the god that cost me my soul. I killed many who were deserving. And many who were not. I killed my father. Zeus. <laughs> that was your father in hell. Is this what it is to be a god? Yeah, they do can tend to kill their parents. Is this what it always ends? Sons killing their mothers? Their fathers? No. We will be the gods we choose to be. Not those who have been. Who I was is not who you will be. We must be better. Rainbow! How's it going? Hi. Bitch. Well, guess we are the bad guys now. In her it's eyes, the end of the yes. game. But I figured can we could do this in two hours choice. if we can. Believe me, I'm going to crash hard. We should finish this journey while I still have strength. You missed it. Fucking Yormi came out of nowhere and bit this giant's no head off, and we got to go inside him. Was the right thing, but she seemed all evil at the end. Not evil. You killed her son, lad. Her son. The death of a child is not something a parent gets over easily. But he was gonna kill her. She would have died to see him live. Only a parent can understand. So you'd let me kill you? If it meant you would live, 
Yes. Look, there was no easy choice. For anybody, brother. But I think we can all agree you did the right thing. The world's a better place with Freya in it. Just give her time, lads. She'll come around. Back to Tyr's temple, then. One last <laughs> time. A little bit, yep. Jotunheim awaits. All right, let's go to Jotunheim. Um, I yeah. Say we cost him. Oh, following you to Jotunheim would bring a cure. All right, back here. Lies, I'm sure. Why did Mistletoe break the spell? Fancy of magic is powerful, but its rules are slippery and elusive. I'm sure it makes sense if you're a witch. Oh, but it's also bloody tragic. Balder was the greatest gift Odin granted Freya. The one thing she treasured from their marriage. She only hoped to spare him pain and spare herself loss. But such impulses can lead good parents to make terribly stupid decisions. So yeah, she uh, she tried to make him invulnerable to protect him because she heard a prophecy that he would die an unnecessary death. So she made him invulnerable. Nothing could kill him. But also he couldn't physically feel anything. And it slowly drove him insane over the course of who knows how long. Whoa. Uh, and all it took was a little bit of mistletoe. And she just kept refusing to remove the, cur uh, the spell. Like... Knowing it would make him happy and better, she was like, nope, nope, not gonna do it. Not gonna let you die. But then, of course, not doing it caused his death, so. Hi, guys. How's it going? All right, let's do this. Time to go to Jotunheim, finally. It's just gonna go. watch a movie with the... Ooh, good. Yay for good moods. things work according to plan. Wait, are we putting... So is Mimir gonna function as the? Go ahead, Lucas Jotunheim, and we'll be on our way. Probably. Boy, we're ahead. Get ready. Oh, right. Got it. Let's hope this doesn't cause you to explode or anything. Oh, I haven't considered that. Maybe we should talk about this a bit more. Nah, I'm sure you'll be fine. <laughs> Ready? I have the head! That's unpleasant! Oh. Now, boy! You okay there, buddy? We must be close. Well, what are we waiting for? Think it's far? We will see. Oh, that doesn't even go into the temple. A word, please, before we continue. Okay. Listen, the last thing you two need up there is a decomposing heat ruin in the moment. Why not I wait for you here? This is between you and the boy. True. But if someone were to fight... My lady sifts soft, perfect sloshers. You done did it. Sorry. We had to see this. <laughs> oh, no. No, 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 no. Fine, damn it. Fine! Watch the head till we return. I can do this. No, no, I can't. <laughs> okay. Ready. Come. Oh, I'm controlling this. Find Jotunheim's highest peak. That's right, we still have Mom's ashes. A lot more yellow than I was expecting.
Boy, don't look directly at it. You'll go blind. I think. Maybe it's not the sun. Boy, wait up. Oh, it's nothing. What the fuck? I hate magic lights. Oh, hey, we're back here. Look! We're on the giant's fingers. I can see the highest peak ahead. Right over there. We did it. We did. What are you doing? Nothing more to hide. Oh, where the chains were bound to him. Can we go now? We're so close. I've never seen Kratos' wrists. They look so weird. Boy. Oh, he put those gloves back on quick. Don't drop mom, boy. Hmm. Boy. It's nothing. I just thought I'd hear voices by now. The Land of the Giants, it's just a lot of statues. Anybody here? What is this place? They must have all come through here when they left Midgard. What was left of them. But are you saying these are the giants? They turned to stone? Why carve all these faces? What if this is all the giants that got out of Midgard alive? Not really many at all. Odin and Thor, ruining everything for everybody. Why do I feel like the game's about to drop something on us? The dream of Midgard. Midgard was a dream of what could be if we shared and collaborated. Jotnar, Aesir, Vanir, Elf, Dwarf, and mortals most of all. It was beautiful, but not everyone is capable of sharing. Some believe anything uncontrolled is savage and threatening. And so we were mocked and tricked and used and then slaughtered. Odin and his tribe were barred from our realm, but it was not enough. The wrath of Thor and his terrible hammer have thinned our number in Midgard to the brink of ruin. There is no option to but, but to withdraw while yet any live to do so. Odin and Thor would have killed all the giants if they could. And they got away with everything. Well, I mean, next game's coming out, so... Where are they now? The giants came back home so they could survive, but I'm not sure they did. A tiny little. Are, they, are we sure these are giants? That's a tiny little bench. Huh? Who's the guardian? What? What guardian? Boy. The Guardian returns. We foresee Midgard's fate. Overrun a second hell. Neither Odin nor his dead may reach Jotunheim. The ways must be shut. The Serpent and the Guardian remained. They alone shall keep our hope. 
When doom befalls the indestructible, only then shall the Guardian return. Until then, we await a better world, one without fear, without greed, without war. We wait for deliverance and justice. We wait for a champion. We will wait for word that gods grow good. Hope that world gets here soon. So, the serpent... Yeah, because they said Yormagondor is a giant. He's one of the giants. He's just a snake instead of a like regular giant. So, there was another giant that stayed behind. I should feel them, but I don't. This place is dead. What happened to them? Why'd mom send us here? One question is answered, and two more take its place. That's really, that's the annoying thing about questions. Wait, no. I was gonna say, they don't have answers, but they do. Whoop. Wait! What did you do, boy? Oh. Something's happening. You broke it! I told you not to touch anything! Oh! It's the axe, which makes that... It's your axe. No, it was... Smaller. Mom's axe. Look. She's arguing with a bunch of giants. She... She's the giant. New giants? That's how the dwarves knew her. That's us. Oh. The first time we met the world serpent. But how? And our fight with Balder. But that just happened. Wait. They knew everything that was going to happen. The dragon in the mountain. The stone mason. All these drawings. Their carvings, boy. This is our story. No. This is your story. But... What does it all mean? That I was not the only parent with secrets. <laughs> Faye was a giant the whole time? You didn't know. She was a giant. I honestly did not see that one coming. <laughs> I'm a giant. And it, oh wait, that makes him. Why didn't she tell us? Oh shit. He's half she god, half sent giant. Us here knowing we would find this. But why not just tell us the truth? Her mother would have had good reasons. Balder was never sent to find me. He was tracking her all along, not knowing she was only ashes. Oh, I wondered what she his had a beef plan was. For us. I trust it. Whatever it is. Besides, she hasn't been wrong yet. Come on. We're so close to the end now. Yes. Yes, we are. Oh. Uh, what? What was that? Wait. No, what was this? I'll be up in a minute. We're at the end of the game. Look. It's Mother's. She was here. What? Oh, she her saw handprint. every step we took before we took it. Like she was always with us. Watching over us. Leading us home. Let's finish it. Hold on. We're about to find out some crazy shit. Well, we already found out some crazy shit, but we're about to find out another piece of crazy shit. Unless you know uh, Norse mythology, in which case you might already know it. Oh, jeez, I've been using wolves the whole time, too. The he oh! Hey, 
A. Are those statues or actual dead giants? I think some of those might be actual dead giants. Father? No. We do it together. Son. Oh. Yep, just reach in and get a handful of mom. There's nothing for us here. Come. So, I get that mother was a giant, which makes me part giant and part god. And part mortal. Right. I guess there's just one thing I don't understand. My name on the wall. Giants called me Loki. Loki. That's the name your mother wanted for you when you were born. She must have called you that to her people. But why? A question for another day. Let us go home. Credits. But did she know it was gonna be like this here? Is this what she wanted us to see? Did she want us to tell the people, or keep it a secret? I do not know. So what should we do? I trust you to decide that. Oh. Damn, that was a good game. But since I'm still playing, it's clearly not so, over yet. Why'd you want to name me Atreus? I know it can't be for a god. <laughs> no. He was a soldier. A Spartan. A great warrior? All Spartans are great warriors. We trained from birth. Our lives were discipline, duty, battle, and death. Life was grim, and we greeted it grimly. Hmm. But Atreus of Sparta was unlike the rest of us. He wore a smile even in the worst of times. He was happy. He inspired us to hope that though we were machines of war, yet there was humanity in us. Goodness. When the day came for him to lay down his life in battle, his sacrifice saved countless others and turned the tide in our favor. I carried him home on his shield and buried him with all the honors of Spartan custom. His memory was a comfort in dark times. Wow, you actually told a good story. <laughs> I mean, you're Stop judging me.
Oh, are we? There we go. Oh, we must be on the world tree somewhere. It's weird that the the temple doesn't I connect here. Well, problem, I guess. But I bet there's still some corrupted Valkyries out there that could be set free. Some other help people. Maybe helping people was part of why Mom sent us out here too. I mean, what would Atreus of Sparta do? And what would Loki do? Huh. That's a weird name. I'm glad we went with yours. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, okay, and there is one Valkyrie left, but I am not good enough to beat her. Um, where's it? What the hell, dwarves? Lads, am I glad to see you. I believe I've reached my limit for dwarven charm. What happened, Mimir? They took an uncomfortable number of measurements and then proceeded to bicker about the weather. Where do you want us to take you? How about the warm confines of anywhere bloody else? Okay, I think what we do now is we head... I think this... Continue exploring, complete Dwarven favors, free dragons, travel to Uh Defeat all legendary corrupted Valkyrie. Okay, um... I think there's one more thing, though. And I don't think we need to beat the last Valkyrie for it. Just need to go home. Think. Before we return to Midgard, I should warn you. More time has passed than you want to realize. The snowfall that began when you slew Balder, it's become something else. The stuff of omens. Omens for the coming of winter. Not just any winter. But a great winter to span three summers. And when it's done, Ragnarok. Ragnarok. Snow. Aye, snow. Lots more snow. And then the end of the bloody world. In that approximate order. Another prophecy. No, brother. Prophecy doesn't expect this for a hundred more winters at least. You've changed something. Prophecy didn't count on you. Oh, yeah, I fucked up fate. Cool. Um. I think that's Fimble Winter, I think they call it. Okay. Dwarves, why did you leave the head? I'm telling you, it's Fimble Winter. I can feel it in my scrot. This is the big one. Stop saying that. Oh, you're making me very nervous. It was bound to snow sooner or later. That ain't just snow, and you know it. It's the end times. How dare you make me the voice of reason? <laughs> Guys, just discussing the weather. Bit of a cold snap oh, that's what he... what he means is Fimble winter's upon us, boys. The winter to end all winters. I can feel it in my screw. Y yeah, we we heard. So if you're heading home, try to keep moving and also to not die. Or if you're not heading home, same advice. Cool. Um. <laughs> so that's what Mimir meant by they took a. Uh... After they took measurements, they argued about the weather. All right. I think we can get this. If not, I'll have to figure something out and just edit it in later. Keep up, boy. I mean, son. Did I make a whole loop? Wait, I don't even know where I started. Knowing. We're finally home. Feels like a lifetime ago. Bit drafty, maybe. It's a right improvement over having tree bark in your tadger. Uh, what's a tadger? 
time to rest. I'm gonna sleep through winter. Also, is the hole still in the roof where we fell through? Yep. Oh no, it's over there. Okay. Okay, this'll do. Sleep. Way ahead of you. What is he laying on the head? in Ragnarok which comes out in like a week <laughs> um yeah that's God of War everybody uh I oh see and I knew I could get it done in like two hours uh okay so I do have one Valkyrie left to fight but she uh spent about 40 minutes kicking my butt and I didn't even get her down to half health once <laughs> you have peeled and cut up the potatoes cool um yeah, no, we are going to call it a night here because obviously tomorrow we have extra life. Uh, so I want to get some rest for that. And uh, oh, I got to help the kids get to sleep because they've got to get up super early and go to their grandparents. So I had a lot of fun with this. I can't wait for the next one. Thank you, everybody, for hanging out. I hope you all had fun. Uh, and I hope to see you tomorrow. Catch you later.